Hello, this is George Senda, the guy from Pittsburgh. Sorry, it's shaking. I shouldn't be walking. And I wanted to show you, this is the old county jail. And if you were to you know, back up a little. If you look up there, that's the exercise yard on top of the roof. And this is long ago shut down. The new one's over there behind that building, down the courthouse. And they've been debating for years what to do with this, whether to tear it down, turn it into a museum, or what have you. But this is the original Martinez County Jail, the Contra Costa County Jail. And so this is another episode of Abandoned Martinez. And you can see the bars in the windows, and bars in the bottom windows all the way along. And there, this thing was built in 1944, and I guess it definitely wasn't up to earthquake code back then, but who knows. And no one's probably gone in this thing for years. And I didn't notice it was a jail. I knew, I've always wondered where it was. So let's go up here. We'll take a look at the door. Somebody always breaks out a window. And so I don't know when the last time they used this was. So I'll go down here now. And let me get out in the street. Luckily, being a holiday and Sunday, there's no cars here. I've been going by this for years and never paid attention to the uh, bars and stuff because I'm usually in a car. And building maintenance uses this for parking. A mighty small jail. We're on Main Street, Pine and Main, downtown Martinez. And so I'm going to come around the other side. County vehicles only. There's a parking lot on the other side of the treasures going. You can't park there either. So you can see the old. I guess that's a water thing. And a little slower. Somehow I can't see me break into the county jail with the sheriff across the street. <laughs> if you could. You have to saw through the bars. And I don't know if this lights up at night, I've never looked. I'm not usually walking over here at night. So. You know, they have a door, but it looks like the, there's no lock. Welded shut. That might have been the jail key, kind of one of those jail key do things. And here's your drain pipe going to, going to nowhere. I guess they cut that off so no one could skitter down the drain. There's your exercise. Whoa. Makes you dizzy just looking at it. And more bars. I'm not sure what that would be for. Air intake maybe. Green pipe. And Greens, more bars, it's a 
surprised me, not a lot of debris. I guess people don't want to get arrested for littering or trashing this place. But this may be one of the few buildings around that won't get trashed till it falls apart. And here's some kind of entryway. I don't know what that was, the roof. Oh, tiny buildings, almost like a bunker. And the light will rust it out now. Wonder if the bulb would still work. And I don't know what those holes are for or why. Here's the back of the treasurer's office. And glass bricks like in bars. I guess I guess this must be some damage or something. See one panel's rusting out, and there's more bars way up there. And this here must have been where they brought the police cars in or the sheriff's cars to bring the prisoners in. There's a light still there. That's surprising. with my glasses being cockeyed I have can't judge even two steps so and all right and that shows the difference to the administration building over there and this small tiny jail that's what 56 66 let's see 50 44 56 66 71 years old Looks like they put some kind of square bolts that might be for uh, earthquake. I don't know what that thing leading there is. It might be for the light. So this is the old county jail. And uh, I'll one day I'll do a video of the uh, new county jail for you. All right, this is George Senda, the guy from Pittsburgh, and this is Martinez Abandoned. Have a great evening. A great holiday and stay safe out there and cool. Bye-bye for now.